Over the years, I've helped capture hardened criminals and escaped convicts. It's what I live for. You see, I have this sort of a love-hate relationship with my job. The streets is flooded with filth. Too many prostitutes, drug lords, and gangsters. <laughs> Seems like there's never an ending. Too many crooks, not enough cops. That's where I come in. I do know one thing. If you're on the opposite side of the law, <laughs> You better pray I'm not the one after you. I'm Private Detective Mike Garrett, and I've been assigned a special case. Look, the only reason I'm here is because you asked about me. I pick up the phone and all I hear are gunshots and screams and your voice muffled in between. Sorry, you had to hear me kill a man over the phone. What kind of shit does Jeffrey have you involved in? He's my little brother, so if I gotta go get him, I'll go get him. Look, I understand that. But you can't go into it alone and blind. I'm a loner, that's how I'm built. There's nothing I can say to convince you to get my truck and we head opposite of all this. Pray not, Dad. Wow. It's been a while since you called me Dad. That screaming you heard on the phone the other day? That wasn't me. That was the man whose face I just split to shit. So now you're a killer. My little girl who was always so afraid of guns. I wish I had some money to give you, but I had to spend almost everything I had just to get down here. That's okay. You've been the best stepdad ever. My son's a fucking dopehead. What kind of people is he in with, anyway? He's in with some mobster type. That big black guy over there in the car, he's your ride? Indeed he is. Well, you're gonna have to get some bullets for that gun. I won't be needing bullets for a while.
Hello. Are you inside or out? Just uh, out here making my rounds. I need you to go back inside and grab a notebook from room one. Sorry, I don't have the clearance. I'll fire you right now if you don't do what I tell you. So, just do it. Now, go get the notebook. And I'll hold the line. All right, I got the notebook. Tell me exactly what I'm looking for. Don't play dumb with me. You've snooped around long enough to know. Now just relay the information to me. Lines three and four. Are the numbers high? Yeah, yeah, looks like it. <sighs> you know what that means, don't you? Right. <sighs> I just got off. I'm headed home to grab a few things. I'll be there soon. So just stay where you are, all right? Yeah. Bye. 
Damn, you know, I, I can't believe this shit. I just saw this bitch in a spacesuit chase this dude with a big ass knife, cut his damn arm off in ball day like I am not lying. I can't believe this shit. I just saw it. Action. Ah. Oh, man. I just got back. The police told me that some lady had stole a machete out of my out of my car and cut a guy's arm off over there. And blood is everywhere. He, he's just all messed up. I, I I don't know. I don't know. Understand what's going on. I, I just went to go get some movies. Movies and uh, I was coming back over. I saw all this commotion and heard all this noise. And once I came back over here, it was just. I, I'm just so shook up. I hope I hope she doesn't kill anybody.